Assalamu alaikum my dear students hope you are well by the grace of almighty allah welcome to nivs home school i am mohammad imdadul haq assistant teacher of mathematics national ideal english version school desit dear students today i am going to conduct a math class of class 2 our today's topic is odd and even numbers it means that some numbers are given we have to separate that numbers into two categories first category is odd and second category is even okay dear students this is our lecture 7 and homework 4 let us start our today's class dear students here i have written separate odd and even number from the following numbers it means some numbers are given here we have to separate this number into two categories first one is odd and second one is even to separate this number into two categories at first we have to know what is odd number and what is even number dear students you know if the unit place of a number is 1 3 5 7 and 9 then the number is called odd number so unit place or ones place if 1 3 5 7 and 9 then the number will be odd and when the unit place will be 0 2 4 6 and 8 then the number will be even so we can write here odd when the unit place will be 1 3 5 7 and 9 even if the unit place is 0 2 4 6 and 8 then the number will be even if unit place is 1 3 5 7 9 then odd if unit place is 0 2 4 6 8 then the number will be even remember this and if you can remember this you can separate all the numbers way in very easily very easily you can separate okay so i am solving the question solution so we'll write here odd numbers and here I will write even numbers. The students at first see what is the first number here. Here the first number is 1075. To know a number is odd or even we have to just notice in the digit of unit place or ones place here ones place is 5 ones place is 5 or unit place is 5 as ones place or unit place is 5 and 5 is odd so the number 1075 is odd so we can we have to write here 1075 now go to the next number what is the unit place here unit place is 3 or ones place is 3 here 3 is odd so this number is odd 7 so we have to write in odd 7 9 3 now go to the next number next number is 904 here 4 is the unit place or ones place unit place or ones place now see 4 is in even 4 is in even so 904 904 number is even number is even now now go to the next number next number is 2650 here 0 is in unit place 0 is in unit place and 0 is even so 2650 number is even so we can write here 2650 okay now go to the next number what is the next number here next number is 3281 here unit place is 1 if unit place is 1 
and one is odd one is odd so the number is odd 3 2 8 1 3 2 8 1 is odd then go to the next number what is the next number here next number is 809 here unit place is 9 here unit place is 9 as the unit place is 9 and 9 is odd 9 is odd so the number 809 is odd 809 is odd okay dear students now go to the next number next number is 4768 here unit place is 8 and notice here 8 is an even number so 4768 will be even so we have to write here 4768 okay now go to the next number here 187 so 7 is in unit place if 7 is in unit place and 7 is odd so we have to write 187 number 187 that is odd 187 now go to the next number next number is 2982 here unit place is 2 as unit place is unit place is 2 and 2 is even 2 is even so 2982 is even so you have to write 2982 below even now go to the next number last number today here 1506 here 6 is in unit place or ones place and 6 is even 6 is even here as 6 is even it means unit place is even so the number is even 1506 so we have to write in even number right below even number okay dear students so i have you are you are clear about the concept how can you separate the numbers which are even or which are odd okay depending on today's lecture you have to do your homework this is homework 4 and i have given 10 numbers here you have to separate these 10 numbers into odd numbers and even numbers do your homework properly and submit your homework on next saturday keep practicing at home avoid by your parents stay home stay safe see you again till then assalamu alaikum